Hello my friends and welcome to another video. Today I am here with Jaden and Kenzie and we are going to try, keyword try, to recreate some cool artsy Pinterest photos. You know when you're scrolling Pinterest and you see a photo and you're like, that's cool, I could recreate that, but could you? Like, what's the actual process that goes into that? Right. Yeah, like, how are these people actually accomplishing this aesthetic thing? Today, we are gonna find out, and this video is sponsored by Threda. So we got some great new to us styles that we're gonna be wearing throughout this video as we take our photos. More on them later. Let's get right into it. Yeah! <laughs> So Jaden, you are up first. Okay, so the kind of picture and idea that I wanted to recreate and get inspo from was this sort of like projector projecting onto you with whatever words that you want to put on there. I don't know, I kind of like it. It's creative. You could say literally whatever you want and you can kind of make it to fit your aesthetic in a way with whatever words you choose, whether it's like a catchphrase that you say or something like that. But I just think it's kind of cool, maybe edgy, dare I say. <laughs> I like it and so I just really wanted to try it. How big do you want the text? Let's experiment too. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so we have set up the projector. I have the words written on the computer and it's time to project. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Is it cool? It, it, it is cool. <laughs> All I see is a bright ball of light. So I need to make sure I don't get in that. Or should we take it from back there and just crop? Oh, we could. Let you me can see. zoom too. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. I actually like the zoom. Yeah. So let's turn the lights down a little bit, right? Yes. Okay. I feel like we need to make the words smaller, but also we need it to go above your head. Um. Okay. We're gonna have to raise this up then. Okay. I can do that. You raise me up. <laughs> Just turns into a full performance. Kenzie leaves. <laughs> Should we zoom it out more? Yeah. Definitely zoom it out more. Okay. Uh, it looks like you have a life mustache though. So. You <laughs> okay. You know what I want to try. You stay right where you are, but do a profile. Ooh, yeah, with life on your face. Life. Ooh. Oh, the, yep. Yeah. But wait, keep your face angled up like that, because then we're not getting mustache. Oh, cute. Are the you laughing. Shaking yes, I am. <laughs> <laughs> Laugh, you're oh, so funny and cute. Romanticize, romanticize it, life. Oh my gosh. Yeah, yeah, show her that one. No, that's cool. Oh, that is fun. The mustache of yours. <laughs> that one is cute. You know what I think is so cool about this too is because projectors have become so trendy. A lot of people have them. Yeah. So you don't, if you have one, you can do a photo exactly like this. You don't need anything extra. No, you literally can do it anywhere in the space, whether it's a textured background or not, which I think is so fun. It is, it's fun and it's cute and it's different. Yeah. And it's like customizable. Yeah, you can change the words, which we should do. We should, yeah, we we should, should. surprise her. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Are I'm we good? I'm so scared. Okay. Don't be scared. No, I'm terrified. <laughs> so serious. At the camera too. Um, or like looking off, being like. Let's experiment. At the camera, looking off. Okay. But, but like stone yeah. face. Really stoic, like Gigi Hadid. Oh my yes, Gigi, work, work. It's deep, it's meaningful. Yeah, oh, oh. yeah, oh, that, yes. But serious. <laughs> <laughs> what does it say? <laughs> I shit my pants. <laughs> I'm 12, I told you. I knew it had to be something like that. Okay, Kenzie like, has one too. Okay. This one is Kenzie's. Okay. Wait, how should I pose for this one? This one's for your socials. Okay. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> yes. I have no idea what it says. Wait, that's actually kind of cute. Right? Subscribe <laughs> to her YouTube. Subscribe. Jada McKenzie. Okay, this one's a win. This one yeah, is this this one's cute. Score. And so easy. So easy. I thought it was gonna be harder like with the shadows behind me or like something in the way. No, big fan. Well, before we turn the projector off, just one more time for good measure. Oopsies. <laughs> okay, you guys ready to see I'm how they turn so out? Ready. Okay, this is the first one. <gasps> 
Wow. And then there's just like. Oh my gosh. Oh, you know? I love that I one love looking it. off. Yeah. Also, like the little light in your eyes. I'm <laughs> sorry. Like, yeah. Yeah. I really liked how they turned out, and I can actually see myself like posting and using these, which I kind of wasn't sure how it was gonna turn out. I mean, they look exactly like that Pinterest style. You nailed it perfectly. <laughs> Romanticize your life, queen. Yes! Okay, I do have some silly ones, all thanks to you guys, actually. <laughs> For starters. <laughs> um, I yeah. love the I love the serious face yeah. with that. The stoic face with just shit <laughs> written over and over. That's so down. good. And the close-ups <laughs> is like <laughs> Wait, but actually those are like so artsy too. That is so funny. I feel like you could post that though and people wouldn't even realize what the words <laughs> say. They'd right. be like, oh my god, repin. Repin. <laughs> oh. And then the one that Kenzie put. Oh, that's cute. Okay, I feel like you should actually use this though. Yeah. 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 Oh. Those are guys. so cute. <gasps> yeah, I liked it. I think it really turned out way better than I thought it was going to. I'm a fan, honestly. I feel like next time we can like experiment with colors. We could even do a picture. I just feel like Ooh, it would be so fun yeah. to experiment with. Yeah, there's so many options for this. It's so customizable and it actually was pretty easy yeah. to do. Yeah. So I'd say it's definitely a win. Yeah. I yeah. think it's a win. Yeah. <laughs> so now let's see what Kenzie has decided to go with. Yes. <laughs> okay. While we were looking for ones for me to do, I really liked the vibe of like the newspaper one, like the newspaper wall. It seemed easy, didn't have to like look at the camera a lot. It was like more artsy for me. But Sierra actually had the idea to swap the newspaper for book pages, which was honestly way more my vibe because I actually don't read newspapers, but I do read books. Because you're a book girly. I'm, I'm a book like, girly. I don't know anyone who's more active on Goodreads than you. Oh, my yeah. number one social media. <laughs> yeah. So it's perfect. Like it's fitting, it's you, and it's taking the idea and Making Customizing it. Yeah, it. Making it more me. So we are taking the vibe of this newspaper photo and we're gonna tweak it a little, customize it a little, make it more Kenzie and use book pages instead. Okay, so I think I'm just gonna be sitting, but we'll still need to make sure that it goes up high enough. Oh, and then also on the floor. Right, I like how she's sitting on the floor. Mm -hmm. I think if we have enough pages for that we should. And then we just have to, you could sit in front of the outlet or we could just cover it. Yeah, we yeah. could honestly just cover it and start there and yeah. go from there. Yeah. Okay, right a smidge. <laughs> yeah, let's do that. Mark right there. Oh, and then we gotta mark the floor. Okay. All right, so that's ideally how broad it'll be, but we can get closer. This is a pretty yes. wide shot. Alexa, play Renee Rapp. Setting up for my shot right now, we decided to do it in the living room. We have a nice blank wall. We have some floor space in front of us. We also have windows that we can use for natural lighting. Um, instead of using newspaper, we decided to do book pages. We got a pack, it's like a variety pack, $9 for 240 on Amazon. And it's honestly coming out even better than I expected. It looks really good, so I'm excited to see how it looks on camera. Okay, do you wanna go sit in the middle and we'll see okay. if we need to add more on the I don't sides? Sprinkle it. it. And a zone, zone right there. Oh, I know. Yeah. Okay. Do you yes. want your props? Yes. How should we stage these? Like, <laughs> yeah. Love. Oh my god, cute. Yeah, you're like, whoa. Oh my gosh. That's so such a good book. Oh yeah, like turn the turn the pages yeah. like that. Oh, cute. Loving it. Yeah. Do you want to see those? Yeah. This is my new Goodreads. I was gonna say, oh if you don't make this gosh. your profile photo on Goodreads, like what are you doing? Let's flip through the pages. Oh, that's yeah. Do lots of page flipping. Yes. <gasps> those are so. Oh. oh that. Oh my oh. god. Look, looking out. Oh. oh. Your jawline in them. Oh. Period. <laughs> So cute. You can do like a peekaboo, like drop the book slightly below, but keep your eyes above it. You have a little bit more of like a pout. With your lips? Mm -hmm. Wait, what is that? What's that word? Prune? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do you want to try any with us like throwing the pages at you? We could try the wrong book pages. Let's try it. Okay. Let's do it. I'm just gonna throw it like 
up. Yeah, throw it up so it can flutter down a little bit. Try to have the pages separate so it doesn't like fall on a stack. On just don't get a paper cut in your eye. Yeah. Aww. Just keep looking down. Okay? Yeah. Two. First. <laughs> how that okay. look? Okay. See how that last one kind of fluttered down? Yeah. So I think we should do less. I think so too. Go. These are so fun. They're I actually so like the book so pages cute. one. Yeah, I feel like it's hard to get right, but when you do, yeah, it looks so. That's cool. one of the ones where it's like you're gonna get one. Yep, but, and that's the one you're gonna post on. But Pinterest. it's fun, right? I actually love this. It was so fun to set up. The pictures are so cute. Yeah, it took us like maybe 30 minutes to do the whole wall, yeah. which I feel like isn't too bad. And like the paper's cute. Like I, I want to save these and make like a thing for my room. Literally make a my little reading, reading book. book. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like this is a photo that you see and it like seems like it might be unrealistic, but it's actually really easy. Yeah, I think this one's such a win. This one is such a win. I love it. I had a lot of fun editing these. I honestly edited them more than I would edit a picture typically, but I really wanted to have like that grainy, moody, vintagey book mm. feel. You guys wanna see them? Yes. yes. So badly. <laughs> Here's like the first one. <gasps> oh, oh I gosh. love that. That's so cute. And then <gasps> some book pages. It worked! It worked! <laughs> it worked! That's so cute. These are so cute, and I'm honestly just blown away by how good the wall looks. I yeah. know. The, it's funny, the wall was like my favorite part. I yeah. feel like, I mean, it, it was a task. Yeah. But it was yes. fun. We were blasting music, and it was honestly just kind of therapeutic. Yeah. We're just sitting there sticking <laughs> pages on and it was easy. Mm -hmm. The cleanup was easy. Like the pages are from Amazon and they're so cute and so like so reusable. Like yeah. I want to scrapbook with them. Totally. I want to like frame some of them and put them in my reading room that I'm going to have. I don't have it yet, but I will someday. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And in the photos, it really looks like it goes on forever. Like you can't tell yeah. that it's just like just that one little right there. It's like, Kenzie, don't move your foot anymore. <laughs> there were definitely some good outtakes of this one though because I mean before we figured out how to throw the pages I mean there's definitely some of them just smacking me right oh in the face my goodness. but you know it's worth it for that final photo yes when, when they fall right they fall right I honestly wasn't sure about the throwing the book pages I was like is that like kind of cheesy but I was talking to one of my friends and she was like that is what reading a good book is it's like you're ignoring the chaos of life around you and I was like fact <laughs> that picture is me reading a romanticy book <laughs> I'm so engrossed in the book. You don't know what's going around and like yeah It's like a visual representation of getting lost in a book. Yes. Yeah. I love that. I didn't even think about that I was just so like logistical about it. I was like Chuck pages at Kenzie <laughs> like, That is the only goal, but that's so like right I and it. I think putting it that way It's like that's my favorite photo now because oh. that is how reading feels to me. Yeah So like do you think this one is achievable realistic? Would you recommend it? Oh? A hundred percent. I thought it was totally achievable. It was fun. This is honestly also one you could just do by yourself in mm -hmm. your house. It would be like a great self-portrait kind of like creative exploration thing to do where you could just set up a tripod and just do it for hours. Honestly, put some music on, try new poses. So fun, so easy. I thought it was a 10 out of 10. So the next photo is mine and I wanted to get a really dreamy, artistic maternity shot and I found the perfect dress for it on ThreadUp, who is sponsoring today's video. ThreadUp is a great way to shop secondhand from home, embrace your individual style, and help reduce your fashion footprint by giving new life to one-of-a-kind pieces at great prices. We all did a little shopping on ThreadUp up, so I, I think a try on haul is an order. Okay, starting off strong with this ANA knit cardigan. I love the style of this. I could wear it buttoned up like this as its own sweater. I could wear it open with like a cute little bodysuit underneath. It's also boxy enough that I can wear it currently 
in pregnancy and the buttons don't pull, but also I will be able to get so much wear out of this post-pregnancy. So cute and cozy. We'll absolutely be living in this. Okay, first is this jumpsuit from Zara. I am obsessed. The lace detail, the pattern. It was originally $75, but we got it on ThreadUp for $21.99, which Hello, like it is so cute. It's so fun. The lace details, like the flowers. Okay, so one of the items that I got off of ThreadUp was these jeans and oh my gosh, I'm ob. Obsessed. So the original price for these Vigos jeans were $83 and then the thread up price was $23.99 But with the discount that was added it ended up being $13.19. So I'd say that's a steal if you ask me. Oh my god, I'm actually obsessed. I'm obsessed. I got this super cute tiered flowy maxi skirt for $10.44. On ThreadUp, estimated retail price was $38. Really nice fabric, great condition, and just like the exact style that I look for in maxi skirts like this. Makes me wanna go twirl in a field, which don't worry, we, we will do. <laughs> okay, I also got this dress. I love dresses, but I honestly don't have have a lot of them and I feel like again this is one that I could dress up I could you know make it more casual with sneakers and a denim jacket I love the green it's so pretty there's like a little floral pattern on it I just think this is so so cute okay so another item that I got was this off-the-shoulder top it's like velvet material I've really been wanting an off-the-shoulder top just like this one but I was always nervous like is it gonna come up on the sides is it just gonna like I didn't know what to expect it literally like stays hello it's still off the shoulder anyways mmm feeling it feeling it oh my gosh I love this dress when I saw it on thread up but actually getting it and putting it on I am so in love or honestly it's giving Megara from Hercules so I should say I won't say I'm in love <laughs> Oh my gosh, it's everything. It's so beautiful. The flowy sleeves, the tiered skirt, and I just, oh, I feel so beautiful and happy in this. This is a dress that I never want to take off. I love shopping on the ThreadUp app. It is so nice to be able to thrift and filter by my size, my favorite brands, so I can find the perfect pieces for me. Also, I favorited a bunch of items on ThreadUp that you guys can shop from. If you want to see some of my top picks in a variety of sizes, there's a link below to shop. And you can get an extra 35% off your first order with code Sierra. Okay, so my photo. I, I feel like there's been this trend for a while of like taking a blank sheet out into nature and you know doing a little posy photo shoot especially for maternity and I was looking at those kind of photos and at first I was thinking of doing something like that but it is a little more like overdone I feel like at this point and then I saw these ones where it's the same idea but someone is tossing a sheet in midair and the person is like posing unbothered in front of it and it seems a hard which i feel like is interesting for the video right and fun and yeah and fun <laughs> and artistic yes. and unique and just a little bit of a different spin on this you know really popular photo style right now i think the cool one about this one is you have to be so prepared like there is a split second for you to get the right shot otherwise it's just like what are we doing yeah <laughs> and we will see exactly how that went <laughs> now <laughs> okay we are out in a random field on the side of the road which honestly could not be more picturesque for my photo i'm really excited about it but i am nervous just about the throwing of the sheet don't know how that's gonna work out and also i feel pressure to be like perfectly posed in every frame because i know timing with the sheet is gonna be everything and so if i am not paying attention when the sheet is like perfectly billowing in the wind like that's the one we've got to go with so i'm hoping we can time this out right i'm hoping i I can keep myself poised and posed and looking majestic in this random field. So I'm excited. Ready? Three, two. <laughs> After you throw it, get your hands okay. in. <laughs> Ready? Three, two, two one. This is actually working better than I thought. Oh, good. Honestly, same. I was worried about this one. And I was like, honestly, we could just hang the sheet on a tree or oh, something. But... Holy, I thought this would be a huge fail and we'd have to hang it. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> but I was like, I'm here for the adventure. <laughs> Are we ready, guys? Okay. And I'm throwing it. That's a. That's. 
Cool, but we do need Jaden to get out. Yes. Yeah. Wait, what? Uh, two. One. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Did you see my. No, I couldn't see you, but I could hear you. Three, two, one. <laughs> but if we do enough of these, eventually it will be like the perfect yeah. throw. Like yeah. that one's cool. That's good. That's cool. Can you get a little bit more this yeah, way, though, Jaden? Two. One. Okay. Those ones were not good. It's fine. <laughs> Two, one. We just need it wider. Okay, we're gonna have Lindsay, who's helping us film today, take the photo so that both Kenzie and Jaden can have a corner of it and really get that width with the throw. Two, one. Okay. I feel like it's that TikTok sound of like, ha 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 ha, again! Ha 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 ha, again! <laughs> again! <laughs> <laughs> Again! <laughs> Again! Oh, yeah. Oh! Wow! Okay. That's beautiful. It really is gorgeous. <gasps> like, what? So yeah, let's do some more of those. Yes. <laughs> Again! <laughs> this one not to work. I thought this was just gonna be a total fail to be honest. Yeah. And I think this is like my favorite. Honestly. Yeah. Oh. I love these and I feel like, you know, a, a maternity photo standing in a field is beautiful, but it's, you know, it's been done. Right. right? But adding the sheet is like a really fun, different kind of artistic yeah. flair. Okay, cool. <laughs> I think that one was a win too. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so like Kenzie, I went a little bit harder with the editing than I usually do because I really wanted to capture that like dreamy, airy Pinterest vibe. So here they are. This one is by far my favorite. This is like stunning. Hold on. Um, I'm sorry. Little House on the Prairie. <laughs> yes, <laughs> but in like such a good, pretty, gorgeous oh way. Oh my gosh. I'm not gonna lie. I thought this one was gonna be a huge fail. Oh yeah. See, that's the thing. There there are about 150 fails on my camera roll. Okay. But there are about five or 10 that are that perfect moment. I did also save uh, some of my favorite outtakes. Oh, yeah. Highlights include Jaden's arms, the Holy, the ghost. Holy ghost. Oh, that is the ghost emoji. It that is. is. That is the ghost emoji. Oh. Twin mattress. Oh, pillow. <laughs> night night. <laughs> Featuring Jaden running out of the frame. <laughs> So many funny ones, and I also love the ones where I can see you guys like booking it booking out of frame. Literally, like, <laughs> and that's the thing. Like, I think this works. I love the photos that I got. I'm definitely excited to post them. But to achieve this, you do need like the perfect conditions, not only in terms of like weather and capturing the photo, but having two really amazing friends who oh. will throw a sheet and then book it for you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Cause you guys were putting in work. <laughs> yeah. It was fun though. That shoot was a lot of fun. It was so fun. It was yeah. something that we have never done before. Mm -mm. Is the concept kind of weird when you think about it? Mm, yes. That's the thing. The more I looked, like I couldn't look at these photos for too long. Cause then it's like, why am I, Why? what is this? But as long as you don't think too deep, it's just beautiful, artsy. It's, it's not that deep. It's not <laughs> that deep. It's one that you look at and you're like, that's beautiful, scroll. <laughs> Totally. Don't look at it for too long because it loses the magic. <laughs> so we also wanted to try some Pinteresty ideas for leveling up a group selfie. We're basically using a phone as a mirror. So one of us like puts the phone on our shoes and the other one we hold it up in the sky. So it seemed easy enough. Yeah. Looking at the photos. We're like, oh, that'll take two seconds. That's so easy and so cute and fun and different. Somehow this ended up, I think, being like the hardest, the hardest one of them. Absolutely. <laughs> like, did we even get one? I, let's find out. <laughs> okay, I think we should start with the shoes one. So we'll just be sitting on the blanket. Maybe yeah. With our feet facing the flowers. That's what I was yep. thinking. That way we have like the pretty background. Mm -hmm. And then so we'll need a phone to take it and also a phone for the shoes. Yes. Perfect. Look out. Whee! <laughs> Why don't we go here and shoot that way? Because then we'll be a little bit more up on the slope. That's okay. what I was And there's some still, there's still some pretty flowers right here. Ready, kids? Smile. Sorry. 
<laughs> not the peace sign. <laughs> the girls in the photos did it. Like it's, it, it is cute and it's different, but it was simply so uncomfortable. I feel like it's cuter if we just like lean far and did one on this phone. Yeah. Oh, wait. Right. Let me. Yeah. Oh. Let's try one like that. Oh, and I'll just cut our feet way better. Yeah. yeah. Our own. Our take. Our different take. On it this. is. It's balancing. Balancing on the shoes. Mm -hmm. is it's hard. hard. Okay. Do we want to try the selfie one? Yes. Yeah. Laying down. And then you're just holding it. You're and holding then I'm just it. taking. Okay. It. Cool. And I'm yeah. just existing. Yeah. I cool. have the shortest arms, so let's try it. And then if I can't get up high enough, you and Jade. Might have to switch. Okay. <laughs> okay. So, this is horrible. This is like the worst angle to ever exist. <laughs> this is so bad. Then do you want to swap? Should we? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. okay. Does that work? Yeah. But right? Okay. God, my boobs are huge. Welcome to my world. These are kind of cute. <laughs> They're so cute. <laughs> First, I thought I was gonna hate this, but it is. It is cute. It is cute. There's, it has potential. Yeah. That's like cute. It could be cute. Anyways. I'm interested to see these when we're back at home. Yeah. Yes. Because it's kind of hard to see in the sun. I can't really see what our faces are doing. Right. But I like the idea of this picture. Yeah, I do too. It's a fun way to take a picture, like with your friends. It's like yeah. a cool, it's like the alternative of a selfie. It's like cute. Selfie. I would definitely try it again. I yeah. would too. Okay, so here are the best ones from our little selfie session. The thing is, with the ones with the shoes, every single frame had the black bars. Yeah. Why are they there? Why are we in jail? It's when you... <laughs> that was exactly what I thought. We're in selfie jail. They're yeah. like, no more. Like, End of the video. Bail. Stop. Put it off. You guys are just too old for this. <laughs> Well, too well, oh, oh, okay. So these ones I feel like didn't work out too well, but the ones in the sky, there were some better options. And I don't know if it was like the positioning of the phone or the lighting, but there were plenty on this one where we were not in selfie jail. In selfie jail. Yeah. I think it's a, a, a unique idea to like spice up a photo dump. Yes. You just know? like throw in there and people be like, oh, that they're cool. Right. <laughs> it's like giving it attention, but it's not the center of attention. Right. Right. Yeah. And you got something going on rather than just the selfie. It actually reminds me of one of my favorite pictures that we took when we were doing the sunrise swim video was like us in the camera, but it was like cute and different and you could see the beach and everything. And I feel like it was kind of that idea, but it just, it was more spontaneous and mm -hmm. it just worked a little better in the moment. So I feel like this is like a fun concept. It's a fun idea using the phone as a mirror, but not something that worked out super well in this application. I think we need to practice a little bit. Yeah. So maybe you'll find a better version in a future photo dump of ours. <laughs> hopefully, hopefully. They're still fun though. I'm glad we have them. Yeah, yes. me too. Me too. Although I did have to take a shower the second I got home because I felt like there were bugs crawling in oh, my hair. Oh my gosh. My ankles like yeah. running through those plants. I should have worn like a beekeeper suit. Yeah. <laughs> there were no bees, it was just the plants. <laughs> so that is all of the Pinterest photos we recreated. That was really fun. So, so fun. fun. It was such a, it was just such a fun activity to do with your friends to really spice up just going out and taking photos. I think having inspo not only makes it different, it makes it a little challenging, but it also, you don't have to come up with a concept on your own. Yeah. But then tweaking it to be like a little more yourself, like, I don't know, it was cool. I really enjoyed it. I I think we should do it again. Yeah, yeah, I think so too. And especially because there's so many ideas and concepts that we could all like take from and even customize mm -hmm. if we need to. I don't know. I, I really enjoyed it. <laughs> Our group one needs work, so kind yeah. of for a round two. <laughs> Let us know. <laughs> Thanks again to ThreadUp for sponsoring. You can shop my secondhand favorites from the link below and use code Sierra for an extra 35% off your first order. Be confident, be kind to your body, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.